last night it happened to me. He's that. <laughs> and peace everybody so i'm finally up and dressed i just put on my little silky situation i got from target a little while ago and i have my robe here so i was like i gotta put on something because i didn't want to put like my actual outfit on yet but i did my makeup and my makeup came out really good i have like a a little bump trying to come up um i haven't put on my lip products yet outside of my lip liner because i was trying to see if i wanted to eat a snack and i didn't want to mess up my lips so just lip liner right now until we get ready to leave um but yeah i was sitting here trying to figure out if i wanted to post a new video today because when i tell you i've been like i'm getting back on my joint i'm getting back on my zoom are we still saying that getting back on your zoom I'm just trying to make sure I get all of my stuff uh, situated and I'm not going a long time without posting because I could always wait till Monday and then post, you know, post on Monday. I might wait till this evening. I want to make sure I get a good enough footage because I've already started a new vlog, which is great. So that way when I'm, that way when it's time to do the new joint, I already have, you know, a bunch of footage from today and so forth. So... Uh... But yeah, I'm really happy. I didn't realize, it's so crazy because I was editing yesterday and I was like, dang, I didn't realize I had so much footage already. I literally had a whole vlog just ready to go. So I was happy about that. Um, <clears throat> anyway, y'all, let me tell y'all something. So last night I got in the bed and as I'm drifting off, right? You know how you have like that sleep paralysis where like something will come over you and you can't scream, you can't talk, you can't, you can't do anything. So that hasn't actually happened to me in a while, but last night it happened to me. And I'm laying down, drifting on me and Avery, finally got comfortable on the bed. I drift off and I felt it. And y'all, please hear me when I say this, okay? I'm not trying to sound spooky, but as I'm drifting to, as I'm drifting to sleep, I saw a vision of like something. And it wasn't like a figure of something. It was just, I could just feel like it was like a dark presence but I could see it. It's like, I couldn't see it, but I could see it. And it was like, I was low-key kind of watching myself laying down and whatever it was, I could feel it make contact with me. And when it did, that's when I felt my body lock up. Like, that's what it felt like. And I instantly was like, Jesus, because no nah, man. And, um, and that's what's happened to me in the past. Like when that's happened, I'll just start screaming out Jesus. And there's been time I've literally jumped out of my sleep screaming jesus like i would just you know so i had to do that last night so when i got up i just sat there for a second and i said okay i'm okay like but see that stuff don't scare me no more because i recognize the god i serve so i was like nah so i just got up and i prayed over the house i prayed over this room i prayed over my mom i prayed over myself and trying to go back in the bed and was asleep. Cause so my mom walked in this morning. She was like, good morning, how'd you sleep? And I was like, like a baby after that prayer. So saying all that to say, that was crazy. But when I say pray over yourself, pray over your house, pray over your rooms, pray over all of the things. I'm not sure if my mom, I'm pretty sure she prayed over her house. Um, but just to make sure y'all, just to make sure, because you just never know stuff. And I don't have time for stuff to be trying to move and groove and I, mean, I just thought that was so crazy because I could literally see it. I could literally see something make contact with me. And when it did, I just felt like, y'all ever seen that movie with that, not leprechaun, but it was like a little lizard thing. And when he didn't have any water, he like crinkled up. That's how I felt inside of me thank you that i am in a straight jacket of grace that i cannot jeez i'm in a straight jacket of grace hey God. i like that straight jacket of grace you are still pursuing and you are still bringing power come on you are still bringing life to marriages you are still bringing authority the authority of jesus to the lordship of christ you are bringing that to my heart and i say thank you thank you thank you thank you Thank you, Lord. Church, let's continue to say thank you in your own way. Let's honor him as Lord, as King, as a resurrected Savior. Yes, Lord. We say thank you for that. Thank you. <clears throat> so I throw my hand, praise you again and again. Because all that I have is a hallelujah. Okay, my little outfit is cute. 
cute today. I said my little outfit is cute today. It came out how I was thinking it would. I'm gonna do my little OOTD. You gotta, we gonna have to do it a little different because since we at Mammy's house. I did my OOTDs at the house. We're gonna have to do it differently since we're at Mammy's house. Since we're at my mom's. See, I don't want all of the sun rays. There we go. Honey, Avery don't be with uh, Avery don't be with the staff now. When she chilling, she big chilling. Grace and Pete's everybody praying all is well with all of you. Another day, another outfit. Today, I'm getting ready to head out with my mom. We're going to go do some shopping and just hit the town. It's beautiful outside. And yeah, I just wanted to show you guys my outfit. So the shirt is the shirt is Zara. My pants are Anthropology. My little sandals are Coach. This bag is TJ Maxx. My Madewell watch, Pandora bracelet, and my TJ Maxx bracelet, and then my normal assortment of jewelry, regular bar necklace, Kendra Scott earrings, and then my Target Sunnies. The braids are gone, y'all. <laughs> so I don't know what I'm doing with my hair. We're going to grow it out or something, but I just still pressed it at home. I'm in need of a trim, but I just still pressed it at home. So this is the hair. And yeah. All right, you guys. Outfit is on. I'm ready when you are, mommy. Just on, ready to go. I will see you guys when we get in the car because I gotta get Avery. That's a good song. You want some gum? I don't know why it's singing like that. Wow. Uh, are you some bomb man? The switch up is crazy. Here we go. Found a few pieces in anthropology and I want to try them on. Let's get into it. So of course it wouldn't be me filming with this camera if I didn't put it in slow motion by accident. So this was actually captured in slow-mo, but I just sped it up so that way it wasn't in slow motion. But anyway, it doesn't have any audio. But I was just telling you guys that I am at my aunt's house, but I was showing y'all this house because this is the house I grew up in. I used to live in Gretna, Virginia, where I grew up in Gretna, Virginia. And this was like my childhood home, but my aunt lives here now. And this little doggy is Simon, and this is Avery's brother. So Avery stayed with my aunt while we were gone. Honey, he wouldn't even let me in the house. But they were playing and having a good time. Look at my baby girl. Hey guys, so <laughs> my mom is about to strangle me. She wanted uh, to make sure I let y'all know that she has put me onto these Premier Protein Immunity, what is it, Immune Health? Oh, it just has with nutrients, it's Immune Health, okay. But they're 30 grams of protein. It's like these protein shakes. And I was looking at the sugar, total sugar, one grams, no added sugar, 30 grams. These are putting my OWIN ones to shame a little bit. They're dairy free. Wait, are these dairy free though? I don't know. These are not dairy free. Mm, never mind. I have my stomach bouncing around the room. That it don't bother me. I'm lactose, y'all, but it doesn't bother me. Stop. Just try it. I don't know. I'm scared now. That's gonna make my stomach hurt. But anyway, the 30 grams of protein, and that's what's getting me because my OWIN ones, they're 20 grams of protein. So I'm like 30. And their caramel flavor. I want to. I do want to taste it while I'm sitting here. I drink the rest later. I do want to oh, taste it. Good. Let me just taste it. They're very good. I don't like the smell for you. It stink. Oh yeah. That's... Mm, but no, that's definitely regular milk. Ooh, oh god. I don't know. I'm gonna put it beside my little pasta stuff. I don't know. I don't know. I'm gonna add some more. I didn't bring another OWIN. I'm gonna pack all of my stuff out that bag. Mm-hmm. So I didn't bring another smoothie with me. It was not an OWIN, it was not a OYX0. So did I only bring one smoothie? But anyway, you guys, I've been up and at I recorded like a video of like some new Sephora products that I got. My makeup came out so good. <laughs> it always wants to come out good when I don't plan to keep my makeup on a while. 
When I'm getting ready to go somewhere, I need my makeup to be on all day. Looks decent, looks all right. But let me just put it on for a video and then wanna take it right back off. Cause I wanna go to the gym. I figured out how to get a day pass at Planet Fitness. So I was gonna go there and just work out. But my makeup looks so nice. I don't even wanna take it off. I kinda wanna record something else, but I don't have all my stuff with me to like record content like I want to. Please, cause you got my girl, look. What's she supposed to put on? She has a body full of long hair. I think she's, you don't know what you want up there. I know y'all like Bill High. No, it's just because you about ready to burn us up yesterday. You didn't want to have on a lick of air yesterday. Yeah, I found the prettiest dress yesterday for Costa Rica. So one of the days out there, it's our dinner night. We're gonna all match. We're gonna all match in some color of green. And when I tell you the dress I found, it's very simple, but it still makes a statement. And it's like, I don't know. It's very cute. It's very chill. Ooh, I could really dress that up. I want to show y'all, but obviously I don't want to like, I want to save it for the day, but it's so pretty. Huh? Nice Gucci belt or a nice- Gucci belt. Type of belt, put it around. A Gucci belt? Cute. Mama, that one little sip, no. I felt like my stomach hurting. Mm -mm. I can't drink that. I can't drink them. If it's not dairy free, it will make, when I say lactose intolerant is one thing, got the bubble guts, use the bathroom. Like drinking milk literally makes me sick. Like I want to throw up, I don't feel good, I'm lightheaded. Like it's, it takes me through. Mm -hmm. Maybe because I uh, looted up with that coffee. Maybe. I, I like that it, I like the taste. It's definitely whole milk up in there. You can tell it's sweet. I'm scared to drink that, that's gonna make me sick. It, and just that little sip got me regretting it. Honey, when I say you made sure that desk and computer was had that much room. To yeah, the, I, I measured it before I moved it. I measured that area. Cause I'm pushing the door and I'm like that itty, it's like a, I mean, I just enough. And the closet too. Mm -hmm. If that closet wasn't there, I'd be doing it. That closet's there, so they kind of breaks it up. But it's okay. It works. <laughs> I'm going to go on that closet. Do you need that printer and all that stuff? I was about to say, if you don't need that desk, I would take the desk out of here and put a nice, cute, like, loungy chair uh, right there by the window. I think that would look a lot better. It's just a lot of big furniture up in here. Just doom, 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 doom. I get it though. It's functional because this is your like, this is your guest room and it's your home office. So it makes sense. I'm just saying it's just a lot of desk, desk, dresser, bed, mirror. <laughs> this closet is quite spacious now. Yeah. Mama, if you don't put that product up in here, you can put the desk in here. <laughs> The whole thing. Girl, this could be your prayer closet. Really, all of these boxes are going in the dumpster. Me and my friend gonna get them and put Please. them in the truck and take that out. Mama, that desk can go up in here with your printer. If you need something, let me go in here. And... Yeah, okay. Out the way. Done. I, I've had it for since I started. I ain't plugged it up, I ain't even used it. So you don't need it. Got it. Yeah, I could put so... the shredder in there. How often am I gonna use that? <laughs> Step on my baby. <laughs> Mama! I didn't know where I didn't even think. You didn't want to got back on the <laughs> Oh, 
She's okay. Ooh, she was mad on it. She was about to bite. I'm sorry, Avery. She Jesus okay. Christ, I didn't know. I didn't. You know, oh, I didn't mean baby. to step on her. I didn't even think nothing about. She was behind <laughs> us. Honey, she was still laying up in that sun. <laughs> on the bed. <laughs> Get off the floor, Avery. <laughs> Woo, girl. That joint was crazy. Oh, that bench I gave, that them two benches you bought from me, what you gonna do with them? You gonna get it. Where they at? Oh, I still got them. Oh. Where we gonna get them? I don't know. <laughs> Embarrassing. Girl. But that would actually be cute. That bench, that wooden bench, that would be cute in here. But that ain't nothing like to relax and sit on. Like you can sit on it, but it's nothing to like sit back, kick up, and relax. Are you okay, baby? Lord have mercy. Goodness gracious, Grandma didn't mean to. You was in the sun relaxing. Grandma didn't mean to step on your paws. You okay? You okay? Oh my goodness. Let me give her a try. <laughs> Honey. Woo. My baby. My baby girl. <clears throat> I'm really good. I'm trying to figure out. There's something sponsored I need to post today, so I'm gonna handle some work stuff real quick. And then <clears throat> I'm gonna ask my managers what um oh, when I tell you I am. Okay, and then <clears throat> And then, could you please keep us posted on what time you're going live with Dove? I'm gonna say good morning. Grace and peace and good morning. Sure thing. So I'm working with Dove. God is good, man. Working with Dove on some content. Um, we have two rounds. I'm um, <clears throat> I'm getting ready to post a video. It's Monday, so I'm just thinking, should I post? <clears throat> I don't know. All right, you guys, I'm going to circle back in a little bit. I'm getting ready to edit a new vlog. Gotta go live with the vlog today. I'm trying to figure out what time I wanna go live with that. Um, Cause I got something sponsored going out today. So I'm trying to think, but it's on a different platform. <clears throat> anyway, I don't know if I showed you guys. I've had these glasses for a little while now. I don't wear them that often, but these have easily become one of my favorites. These are from Warby Parker and they're in the style Latrell. They're just beautiful, beautiful glasses. <clears throat> I actually want to put my prescription in these, but I'm scared it's going to mess them up and have them look a little different. So I don't know. But they're so pretty. All right, y'all. BRB. <laughs> y'all, I done got in my car and my screen is not on. My screen is not cutting on. And yeah, my screen is not on. The gag is I can drive the car. Yeah, I can drive the car. I just, I can't see anything on the screen. I mean, the gag is I can use the car. I'm gonna just have to use it. I can use the car with the screen not on. I don't understand this. <laughs> I understand this. Let me call. Call Tesla customer service. Oh, they got me on hold right now. I'm so sorry. I don't even mean to get right beside you, but I can't see. There she is. Okay, so if you have a Tesla and your screen goes out and it doesn't want to cut back on, hold down both of the scrolls on the steering wheel, hold them both down until, it says for about 30 seconds, 
and just wait for the um wait for the uh, Tesla logo to pop up on the screen and it should be back up. We're back up now. What the heck? <laughs> I was about to say, what's wrong with my car? I don't know why I even did that to begin with, but I digress. But I'm getting me a little bit of charge in so I can get to the actual gym. But while I'm here, I'm gonna write out my workout, which I kind of did this morning, so I'm a little ahead of the game. So today I'm gonna do, I wanna do, I don't have a Smith machine at my gym, so I kind of wanna take advantage of having a Smith machine today. Um, so I'm gonna use a Smith machine and I wanna do like these clothes. I'm gonna do, um, quads today never again will i work out and make up that was annoying but i got my workout in for lunch since i'm not at home and i don't have all my stuff i still have one more meal left at my mom's house that i can eat so i think i am going to chow down on that um but my mom asks if i could pick her up some lunch so i'm gonna go to tropical smoothie and pick her up her up a little bit of a um a lunch just because on her lunch break, like, you know how it is on lunch breaks. It's like your whole hour is gone trying to go get lunch, right? So I'm like, it's probably just better if I go and get your lunch. So that way when I bring it to the house, you can just like clock out for the moment and eat. And you can actually take the full hour to just kind of, you know, eyes off the screen, just chill. You don't have to worry about trying to get the food, drive you know all of that so you can just focus on eating so i told her i would go pick her up lunch i'm gonna get me a um a smoothie i think she wants a smoothie as well so i'm gonna get that and i'm scared to drink this but this is the only protein smoothie i have on me right now and i need it i've already had my pro i had a protein bar which my protein bar was 20 grams of protein this is 30 so that already puts me um, at the halfway mark of 100. So that puts me right at 50. Then I got my my wrap that has some chicken in it. That's protein. I'm just scared it's gonna hurt my stomach. Hold on y'all, I already know the camera sound crazy on this thing, hang on. I want, I want to drink this, but I'm scared because it's got dairy in it. Not even go home today for real for real i might go home tomorrow mm -hmm. just because i got some content i need to film for a brand and i can do that here because i got the stuff with me so i'm gonna go ahead and do that in there stressed out we have peanuts i'll be walking hard now <laughs> <laughs> can y'all tone it down simmer down up there please just calm down a little bit <laughs> well we were getting ready to go to target oh so she wanted to complain about some art we're gonna give her something to complain about yeah people are dirty people are dirty I'm not going to I'm just going to stick this in my sack. Well, oh, every size like is gone. Every size is gone. All right, y'all, we are in Target, and I'm looking for some. I don't think that's big enough, though. Oh, I got a big one. We're looking for some stuff in Target. You already know how that go. Looking for some travel essentials, little things here and there. My head is too big. No, it's that not. looks perfect. You don't need anything bigger than that. You need the big ones, though. You need, like, the big... You need the big sombrero hats. I don't know if mine is bigger than that or not. That black one you got? Uh -uh. It's the same. I've thing. got a cream color one. Oh. Cream, but like that um, outfit you got. I'm just trying to figure out if I like this. See, shirts like that, like cute cover ups and stuff. You know? Y'all, look at this cute. Let me not do too much. Oh, well. yeah, yeah, yeah. Not need that. Not gonna wear it. This is a cute little yellow jacket. Might be too hot for this dress. This is small. Uh, this is cute. Where am I going? Uh, 
This is the smile, and that's the medium. Not a lot of difference. It's like I like it. Uh, I don't know. It looks kind of. You see how the medium is? Mm -hmm. See the medium? It's a little looser. Okay, see stuff like this, mom, like little cute skirts with the slit in the front, it's cute. And they do sell Levi in here now. Like the jeans? Jeans, jeans, shorts. Ooh, are these sets or no? We have some stuff in here, like this? Stop, but it's a two. Whoa, this is cute as... I didn't found the section I was trying to be in, and I wonder if this is all they got left of this thing. This little jumper, y'all. Oh my God. This is so cute. Okay, I see a 10. There's a 10. Oh, they didn't ate this up. Girls ate this up. This is so cute. A 10 though, or a two. This is gonna be too little. What made you say that? Chickpeas and all that. I'm not going looking for that. Okay, well, I don't know. That's some good salmon in here. Look at that. Mm. You got salmon. The thing about it is, are you buying this to actually cook some of the recipes, or are you just doing it for decoration? So you just need to go to a thrift store, I guess. This looks pretty. Look at these, though. Mm -hmm. now that's, now is that the skinny taste? Okay. It's real something you might make. For real though. Salads. Mm. Okay. I really give it to chefs though, because they really be whipping it up. I'll be running out of ideas. Same thing. That's cute. That one's cute. My mom has this cute little area in her apartment. She wants to put some. um she wants to put some cookbooks right there because it's like kind of sort of in the kitchen. Yeah, let's get the skinny taste book. And it's wrap the freak up. Can't even look through it. I know that's right. That so you can see what exact, it's exactly exactly the rip off. Yeah. Exactly. Like nothing good. Exactly. This smells good. Do you like um, bar soap? Something um, about a bar. Mm -hmm. I like body wash too. Something about a bar. <sighs> okay. All right, John found me some new deodorant. I'm gonna try these out and see. Girl Scout. These are my favorite cookies from them too. Let me see. That's funny. That actually smells really good. Wow. I like Quest. All right, y'all. Found these blueberry muffins I want to try. I was so confused because I didn't know how many came in here. But four comes in here. I'm going to try these. 20 grams of protein. It is a little bit of added sugar. Well, two grams of total sugar. So zero added sugar. Okay, yeah. 20 grams of protein. And the Quest cheese crackers. They're good. Mm. They're good. 10 grams. Nah. But I do see my favorite are snickerdoodle cookies. What if these are nasty? Do you think these are nasty? 15 grams of protein. Get them, let me try them. I mean, you won't know until you try them. I'm not getting them candles and stuff. I need to buy what I need. Then you can see, see, see. So I'm just like scanning out to see what kind of protein. That's gonna, the name of the game. We're gonna grow these glutes. That's the name of the game. No, we're gonna protein. grow these glutes by any means necessary. Cause one thing about Ooh, it, I my mom decided to not give me any. Thanks girl. Love you. I can't have the nanny took everything I had when she My was My sister born. took everything. She took everything except for the breast. Oh yeah. She, she didn't take them. You really didn't pass those on to either one of us. Yeah, we are headed into Ulta. Yeah, I need to wash my car. This is pathetic. Y'all, these are my new shoes. Oh, brother. Ooh, what is this? Hydrating skin enhancing tint, SPF 30. This is cute. Enhancing tint. I'll just put it on the back of my hand. You can't even see it. I think I might be 285. 270. I love this like green. 270? Mama, let's know. That's too light. Try this one. You you know you and I were the same color. That's nothing really just looking. Mm. 
Mm -mm. The way it blends in though, your face is lighter than your hands and stuff. Mm -hmm. You don't want to try it. You don't want that color. This is lip and cheek. Ooh. I, like I was about to say, you can always tell like what's on the thing because of the, um, whatchamacallit. Here's the whole collection, you guys. They have concealer as well and a mm -hmm. max yep. intensity featherweight lipstick. Let's get into that. Eye. And eye stuff too. They got brows. So they got more lipsticks. Ooh. Hold on. I thought it was just um yeah. cheek and face. <laughs> we got concealer and everything. So let's try. Let's find a nice concealer color. I like the name of this Wind Beauty. That's cute. That is cute. Cause we are winners. Ooh, this is a nice color. That's natural. What is this? Happen. 270. All right, that's a lightweight lipstick. Oh, they got lip serum. Yeah, they have a lot of stuff in there. I'm here for it. I want to see all the stuff. What is this? Spark? Oh, this is a matte lipstick. All right, I got a cheek color that I think would be pretty. Let's do one of these. I think they're priced pretty well too. Let's do one of Understand. Because we are going to support her new makeup line. And they also have a up to 24 hydration, high shine finish lip gloss. She watching the mirror the whole Mmm, turn a life to those who is persistent in doing good, seek glory, honor, and morality, but obeying unrighteousness. He will repay each one according to his works. Eternal life to those who by persistence in doing good, seek glory, honor, and morality, but wrath and anger to those who are self-seeking and disobey the truth. <laughs> The bird video stuff is for her. And she ain't paying no attention. Anywho, we are en route to head home. I'm so ready to be home to get back into my routine, which I didn't really get off of my routine. I still went to the gym. I left on a good day, like, you know. But I'm excited because I already know what I want to do for my workout. So that gets me excited when I know what I'm going to go do. But anyway, I'm super excited because... Oh, shoot. I'm trying to use my hotspot to post this video to Instagram. And it's taking forever. These rows of flames are good to know fire. Don't you worry. Shopping continues, so as you guys saw in my recipes, you guys, I <laughs> woo, honey, I'm on 495. If you know anything about 495, baby girl, baby girl, baby girl, it is standing traffic at the moment, it is crazy. And on my map, all I see is red lines. So, uh, so you know, what? here's a good time to pick up the camera, just check in with y'all. 
I have about 47 minutes till I get home. That's with traffic. I was supposed to be at home. I was supposed to be home at 4.30 and now it's putting me at 4.55. Just a minute ago, it was 5.30. So I am happy that it went back to kind of sort of original times. But yeah, it's standing traffic right now. It's literally like stop and go. So I'm just, oh, oh brother. And that's how I feel right now. But I've just been in here worshiping. I have to pee. I drank so much water before I left my mom's house. I don't know what I was thinking, but I thought the time that I left, I was gonna miss like a whole bulk of traffic, but I'm kind of running right into it. And yeah, so that's been fun. Luckily I have stuff in the back. I have some snacks back there. So I've been chomping on some protein chips. Um, I still have my cashews up here. So like I've been eating, I haven't even been drinking any water because I just can't even fathom the thought of drinking anything at this point because I have to pee so bad. And I don't wanna think about it too much because there's nowhere for me to use the bathroom now. Like I'm stuck in traffic, but. It is all good. It is It is okay. The Lord has been gracious to me, keeping me safe in this traffic. And he knows how I feel about bridges and he's been keeping us safe on these bridges and when we're stuck on them. I'm on one right now, but listen, I give God all the glory and honor and praise because he's gonna keep us safe and I appreciate him for that. All I'm thinking about is getting home getting Avery situated. Sunny was just texting me out um, saying that she wanted to go to Bark Social. And she was like, I was gonna invite you to Bark Social. But she was like, mm. we got each other's location. So she'd be checking in on my location. She was like, mm, I don't even know if you'll be back in time. And I'm like, child, you already know I'd come. And I would love for Avery to get some doggy time and outside time and stuff. She got a little bit at my mom, but um, child. I did not expect this traffic to be like this, but it is okay. But I am just ready to get home, get all this stuff out my car, you know, get situated, and so I can hit this gym. I've been, that's how like, I don't know if I'm just become obsessed or something, but I've been in the car like, okay, I'm gonna do this exercise, and I'm gonna super set it with this, and I'm gonna do this exercise, like I know exactly what I'm gonna do. And then my eye over here is getting red. Don't know why, I don't know what I did with my eye drop. I keep losing my eye drop, y'all. Y'all, when I tell y'all this traffic, like I'm telling you it's standing traffic like we we cruising for bruising like we just chilling like I've memorized everybody's license plates at this point everybody's chilling over here she's yeah, it's standing traffic for the next like six miles so I'll check back in y'all probably won't see me again until I'm in the house I didn't got all my fr uh, furniture I didn't got all my bags in I'm gonna have to go I got some mail I need to get, so I'm gonna have to go upstairs. I'm gonna go ahead and take Avery upstairs and I'm gonna come back down with my wagon and put everything in the wagon. I love that wagon. Because at some point I'm going to the gym. I might eat a little something before I go to the gym, but then again, I might be all right to swing it because I've had a hefty breakfast. So yeah, when I wanna get home, I'll make like a sandwich or something. And um, then I'm gonna go to the gym. But anyway, I will see you guys in a little bit. BRB. girl night you can't tell me nothing I'm back home <sighs> but y'all look one trip shawty I've been trying to tell y'all Avery's bag my purse my suitcase my work bag I brought with me and then my wagon with all my shopping stuff in it Home, mm. I like to come on in and unpack. I like to come on in and unpack, get everything situated. Avery is hungry, so watch her bowls at my mom's. Avery, come on and eat. So I, I was checking my mail. I got this. It says Hello Sun. Uh, I can never say it right. It says Hello Sunshine. It's from It Cosmetics, and it's a um, it's an SPF 50. It's called the Invisible Hydrating Serum Sunscreen. So that's super nice. I wonder how it is though. It Cosmetics always has some good stuff, so I wouldn't be surprised that this is bomb. And plus the fact I'm gonna need me a nice sunscreen to have with me going on this vacation. No cast, so that's great. I'm gonna put it back in the box so I can take a picture, but I like it. I kinda wanna do like a haul situation for you guys. I've got a lot of stuff. I don't really do a lot, a lot of shopping, but I did some, some shopping. Um, I'm gonna unpack my work bag. Me and this good old wagon, y'all. Let's start off with, <laughs> let's start off with Foot Locker. I got some more shoes. 
Now my last vlog, I showed y'all my purple ones. Uh, I showed y'all my blue ones, right? But these aren't the ones I bought. I bought these like a week and some change ago. Got those in the mail, but the ones I have on are the new ones that I actually bought. And I was with my mom. Oh, it's gum all on the bottom of my shoe. Ooh. I'm gonna have to get the gum all the way off. I got most of it off, but there's like gum on the bottom of the shoe. But outside that, the shoes are fire. They're so nice. I wanna wear these to the gym today. I was wondering what was on the bottom of my shoe because as I was walking, yeah. Because as I was walking, I was like, my shoe just feels uneven. But I was just like moving and grooving, so I didn't really think too, too much about it. But that's what that was. It had gum. It was gum and mulch. The mulch was like stuck in the gum. Embarrassing. Okay, so I went to Anthropology and I saw the skirt. Y'all saw that skirt. The only thing, which this is unheard of. Anytime I go to Anthropology, I am always like doing the most up in there. Like, cause I just love some of their clothing. It's just different to me. But they had this beautiful white skirt and I tried it on for you guys and I think it's absolutely stunning. It's so pretty. It sits just right on the body and I'm like, yeah. This would be such a nice, um, this would be a really nice piece for like a little picnic situation or maybe even, I mean, maybe like an all white party. I don't know, just anything, like a nice white skirt that you can wear. With anything how i'm envisioning it is with like some kind of button up like a loose button up y'all know how i wear my button up shirts i'm thinking of that situation with like some chunky sandals a little purse yeah love it love it love it i went to sephora and got some goodies um the video is live on my instagram page i was showing you guys what i got um but i'll show you guys here too just in case you don't have instagram it's empty so <clears throat> i just kept everything in the bag so i didn't like mix anything up but I got more of my Milk Setting Spray. This is a new blush I got from Rare Beauty and it's so pretty, y'all gotta check it out. And I'll do my makeup, probably not today, but I'll do my makeup sometime soon and I'll show you guys these too. This is my favorite setting powder, so I'll just re-up on that. I got the Josie Moran Body Scrub. I'm so excited to use this when I get back from the gym later. Baby girl. Um, I got some more Hourglass Concealer. I got a new shade. I got my regular Dune. 7.5 but then I got another shade that is for like contour purposes and it looks that's why I was saying like in that video I put on so many layers of makeup it is what it is I did two skin tints and a foundation but that's just my routine right now because the kind of the texture of my skin the way I have to do makeup is so interesting I do not have like oh, where where are the pores I don't have that kind of skin so I have to do things in my routine that really gives me like a really smooth flawless base so that's what i do so anyway got those goodies from sephora i showed you guys on instagram most of those but i will i'm gonna do my makeup during this vlog at some point um probably not like today today but probably not like the next clips or something knowing me um also haven't been to bath and body works in a little hot breeze but i went to bath and body works and i got me a new candle I got this one, it's the Palo Santo. Now hear me out, y'all. I don't know what the names mean. I remember someone commented a while ago and was like, be careful with some of these names because it's like that kind of stuff. But listen, I'm just here for the smell. I will rip the label off, I don't care. It's just the smell I'm here for. It smells so good, so, so good. Um, and then I got a bunch of room sprays. These room sprays are my favorite, but they have the Palo Santo, the White Barn room spray. So I got two of those. They had a sale, like two for two for something. So I ended up getting six. So I was like, okay, sale. And then I don't know if y'all remember, but the mahogany coconut. If you watched my vlogs last year, I talked about this a lot because they, it's like they brought this fragrance out and then it vanished. And I'm like, where is mahogany coconut? And it's to the point that I have, let me see if I still have it, hang on. I'm not gonna touch it because I want y'all to see this. I have had one, because I bought one because I didn't know how it was going to smell. 
I have held onto this same mahogany coconut room spray for the last year because I didn't know if they were gonna bring it back. Look at this, it's sitting right here. And it's almost empty, but I hung onto this because I was like, y'all, I don't know when they're gonna bring this back. And I did not wanna run out of it. It is my absolute favorite room spray. So of course, when I saw that they had more, I racked up. So I just got two, I didn't wanna do two too much. But I got, oops. <clears throat> but I got two of those. And then I got, I got mahogany vanilla, which smells really good. And then I got this newer one that's called Blue Verbena and Lime. Verbena and Lime. Now this one's really different. One of these I might do for my car. I like my car to smell some kind of way. Like we kind of over the new car smell. I had the car, not a, not a year yet. August will make a year I've had my Tesla. But at this point in time, girl, I want my car to smell like something. So I might use one of these as a room, uh, room spray and then for my car. Now I was trying to kind of hold out from showing this, but I don't care, y'all gonna see this dress. I don't care about all that. So me and my Costa Rica travelers, um, one of the nights when we have dinner, we are going to wear all green and or just like a variation of green and i have a green dress i have a green dress that i was like okay i'm gonna wear this but when i saw this one i was like wait this one actually might suit me better in terms of what i want to wear just kind of like the vibe i want to give i guess i want to get really chill but still something this dress is long look at the color it's a variation of green it's like a greenish yellow but it's so pretty it's more green in person than it is on camera um, so there's that. We also went to Ulta. So I can't show everything in here, but I got a couple of goodies for my travelers in here. But also, oops, also we got this e.l.f. spray, which is the same as the e.l.f. primer that I be using all the time. It's not the green one. I used the pink one, but I used to use the green one, but they got a spray. So I was like, gotta get that. And then Serena Williams came out with a makeup line called Win, Win Beauty. So I picked up some goodies with that. I wanna do a review here soon. So once I kinda of get settled, I will get to work. And I wanna do a review on this. Um, so I'm really excited, but I got the skin tint. And somebody had already DM'd me and said it oxidizes really bad, so just be mindful. And I'm like, oh Lord. So I got the skin tint. I got, this is a lip and cheek color. So you can kinda of use this for kind of all of your face for different things. And then I got a concealer and a contour concealer shade. So we'll try that out as well. I love these like Germex things. So I got me a little Touchland, a little new one. Cause the one I have right now, I think is, the one I have, child's about empty. Let me see how much is left in there. Oh yeah, look at this. This joint is almost gone. So it'll be good to re-up on that one, put that one in my purse. So that was all I got from Ulta. What else we got, y'all? Okay, I'll get to these in a second. Oh, also, Target. Oh! So me and my mom went into Target and I literally went in there for deodorant and I left with a bunch of stuff. But I had like almost $30 worth of points. So I got $30 off my order. I was hyped. Anyway, I saw this bag. Excuse me, Avery. I saw this bag and I thought this was really cute. I'll try to link everything that I can find. But I saw this bag and I thought it was so cute just for like, a cute little beach bag, you wanna go by the pool. I don't know, I just thought it was very, very, very cute. And it was thin, honestly, I thought it was ready to be $40, but it was 18 bucks. So I was like, okay, I like it. And I feel like it's cuter because it got all this paper in it, so it makes it look big. So I feel like I'm kinda of scared that when you take stuff, like when you take the paper out, it's gonna be kinda of flimsy looking. Well, I guess I can show you these two. I got two bags of these. I got hungry in the car, so I opened up one and dogged them. But these are my favorite Quest chips. These are protein chips. And these have 19 grams of protein, just in this little bag of chips. More Target things. I saw this really cute matching set. It's by the brand Wild Fable. So I thought this would be really cute, just kind of like a little throw on situation, kind of walk around, it might be hot, and it comes with the shorts as well. I thought this was really cute. I hope this is cute. The name is going back. I'm gonna be like Sunny. Sunny, let me tell you something. Sunny will buy something, she will return it. She don't play. So I'm like, I'm turning into Sunny. If it's if it ain't gonna work, I'm taking it back. So I got that. So I'll try that on and see how that fits. And then I got this bathing suit. Here is the print. I'm gonna try to see up close. Like the print I thought was cute and it's cream. 
And I thought this was really cute, so I definitely want to try this on and make sure this fits how I think it's going to fit. I hope it does, but we're going to see. And if it don't, guess where it's going? Back. <laughs> it's going back. It's got to. It's got to. I got these Quest Blueberry Muffins, 20 grams of protein. These are delicious. I got these. I don't know how they'll taste, but I got those. And then the same protein that my mom was telling me about, I ended up getting one of those too because they were really, really good. So she was putting me onto those. She was like, make sure you tell your people that I put you onto those. I'm like, okay, mom. I had to rip on some deodorant. I ended up getting the No White Marks on 100 Colors Advanced Care Dry Spray from Dove. So I got that one. That one smells pretty good. I like this one. And currently, I don't use Dove deodorant. Like, I was, but then I started using this other deodorant. <clears throat> um, for some reason, it doesn't keep me as dry as I like to be under my arms. I do not like to feel sticky or wet under there. I just, no. I want it to be dry. And this is really the only deodorant that kind of does that for me. So I got more of that. And then I saw the girls talking about this one. This is the Shea Moisture. This is the Shea Moisture Coconut and Hibiscus Fresh Anti-Press Print Deodorant. 48 hour sweat and odor protection. And this one, it smells so good. So when I smelled it in the store, I was like, I'm gonna try it out. Um, I got this Vaseline hand cream to keep in my purse because you already know my hands love to stay ashy. And then I've been seeing the girls talk about this too, the Vaseline Radiant Even Tone Body Lotion. Really want to try that one because everyone that I've been seeing use this, they're glistening and I'm like, ooh. So we got some more One Art Active stuff, so let's get into my new package. And honestly, y'all, after this, I'm done. Khaki. This must be, isn't khaki to green? Maybe I'm tripping, but these are both considered khaki. Yeah, y'all, these are both considered khaki, and I don't know if y'all can tell, but these are not the same green. Like, this one is definitely lighter. Y'all see that? Now, I'm excited for this one because this one, I got, I got some uh, sports bras. It was covering here, you know, nice support here. That kind of thing. I'm not a big fan of the little padding on the inside, so knowing me, I'm gonna take them out. Um, but yeah. All right, so we got, okay, so we got evergreen, green leggings. Love this color. This color is so nice. And then, I did, y'all, I did the same thing with Gymshark. When I found something I really like in gym clothes, I went ham. I got a navy blue. This blue is beautiful. And the same colors I'm showing y'all, I got them in shorts. So that's the next like order that's coming in. And I'm done. I'm done. I cannot wait to get my nails done. My nails look terrible. Um, oh, and yeah. And then same thing as the white. I mean, same thing as the red. I got a white one. So I just kind of want to see how these sports bras are in the gym. Like I said, I'm going to take the padding out. I'm just not a big fan of the padding. I just like the padding just like dust. It, it, it almost makes this area bigger and I don't want that <laughs> so I always take the padding out and then I'll add like my little nipple coverings or whatever just that way try to hide I don't know I just I just wanted to get out and enjoy myself and all the things so that's what we did this camera is overheating but this is everything that we got cute 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 <laughs> Good morning, everybody. Praying all is well with all of you. It is a new day. And it is the next day. I'm finally home, somewhat situated, getting back into my routine. Um, this morning is a little different. I'm headed to the gym, obviously, but I'm going to a different gym this morning. That should be fun. I'm excited just to kind of see a different gym. Yeah, I have my shades on the sun. I mean, it's out, but it ain't out. 
you know what i'm saying like it's kind of like that cloudy sunny day but anyway yeah i'm getting ready to go to the gym i'm feeling pretty good i'm gonna be honest with you i did not sleep well last night and it was one of those sleeps where it was like i had so much potential to sleep well and just didn't and i don't know why i didn't <laughs> but it's okay so yeah i did um i did get some rest last night and um they do so much construction down here for no reason it's back i believe i think they said we're gonna do back and triceps biceps or something like that so i am excited because the last two days i have been killing my legs i mean killing them i did a quad day on monday and then last night when i finally got back from traveling i did hamstrings and glutes focused and of course i did my sprints and my 10 minute on the stairmaster that is like my new remedy that's what i do right now i do 10 sets of sprints 30 seconds 30 seconds on 30 seconds off 30 seconds on 30 seconds off like go all the way until i'm done i go between nine speed to 10 speed and again you run for 30 seconds and then you rest for 30 you run again for 30 seconds and i do 10 sets or 10 rounds or whatever and yeah those are my sprints and then right after if no one's on it i will hop on the stairmaster for 10 minutes i'll stay between speed five and seven um when i really want like to get it i'll put it on seven when i really just kind of want to focus a little bit more i'll put it on five but i go no lower than five no more than seven and i and that's my like no matter what workout i'm doing is that white in my hair no matter what workout i'm doing i always do core my sprints and then my 10 minute on the stairmaster and that's like my little that's my little remedy right now um and it's been great i've been seeing changes a lot and it's changes that i've been wanting to see it's changes that i needed to see for me to be like all right i'm doing something so and i'm telling you after lifting and you go do some daggone sprints that has been a huge contributor to a lot of my leg growth and I don't know what i don't know why i didn't do these before but yeah just like doing a focused leg workout and then you finish off with some sprints so that's my routine right now so anyway like i said i'm going to the gym we're gonna do a little arm day so much construction so so much construction um i'm really excited so it'll take me a little minute to get there just because of traffic this morning you know school traffic then just traffic in general i guess um, but I'm gonna listen to my gospel music and chew my gum in peace. So I will see you guys in a little bit. BRB. Grace and peace, you guys. I am in traffic again. I am headed to Bible study, and um, yeah, it's like five o'clock, six o'clock traffic. I'm trying to get to church. Uh, church starts at seven, so it's six forty. I'm about 20 minutes away because of traffic, so I may be a little late or maybe right on time. But I wanted to get there for the pre-service prayer, which they pray about 15 minutes before service starts. I wanted to get there for that, but traffic is <sighs> holding me up. Me and Sunny was literally on the phone. I have terrible service through here, so the phone literally just like disconnected. But we got plans set. Um, so this year, April 20th, will make four years since I have been on my own, working for myself. And um, it has been amazing. So we've made dinner plans. I put a certain amount of number of people down. Um, but this is definitely kind of last minute situation. So I'll see who can come. If not everybody can come, it's gonna be okay. I at least know Sunny can come. Um, so we'll, we'll see. But again, I'm trying to be more intentional about celebrating things this year. So I celebrated Sunny's birthday, took her to the spa. You know, like I said, I wanna celebrate this this month. Going to Costa Rica, we got the panel coming up. Definitely wanna kinda celebrate Sunny too. This will be her first panel that she's speaking on. So this is uh, super exciting. And I'm grateful to be doing this uh, side by side with her. And then what else is after that? So when we come back from Costa Rica, then we got Laceless birthday. So we're gonna have to plan Laceless birthday. And then we got my birthday. <laughs> so like there's just stuff going on. Like my dad just celebrated his birthday. Um, my cousin, oh man, my cousin's birthday is actually the day after when I wanna have my dinner. Her birthday is coming up. Like. There is just so much, so, so, so much going on these months. Like this time of the year is so busy and so just, I'm grateful nonetheless, but yeah, y'all. I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna, I'm gonna, 
I'll be watching Destiny, um, all of Destiny, and she'd be like, I'm gonna call y'all back. <laughs> I think that is so funny. I'm gonna call y'all back. Like, what? That's so cute. Yeah, I'm gonna call y'all back. Uh, I'll pick the camera back up when I get to church. Because this traffic, like, when I say, this traffic is like stop and go. Like, look at this. This is like, and then you got people coming from the side too. It's like stop and go, stop and go. So let me be a good driver and pay attention, BRB. Grace and peace and good morning, everybody. Praying all is well with all of you, y'all. I've gotten sick out of nowhere, but not this sick like the last time I got sick where I lost my voice and all this extra stuff. La okay, let me get the storyline. So yesterday I went to Bible study. It was my fault, but I had eaten a late lunch. So I was hungry at that time. So when I left the house to go to Bible study, obviously I, I wasn't thinking about eating at that time. So I went to Bible study. So of course after church, like it got kind of late. I'm like, dang, I'm hungry. I don't really feel like cooking when I get home. Just go run by and get something. Usually if I go to Chick-fil-A nowadays, I go and get that cool wrap. That's it. I don't get no drink. I don't get no fries. I don't get anything. But I got on the scale yesterday. And for some reason the scale was three pounds like it looked like I had lost three pounds. And I'm like, hold on. I'm like, y'all, I've been trying to maintain my 142. Why in the world am I 139 on the scale? So I I don't know. I just went into my mind. I was like, you know, I'm finna just eat whatever right now. I'm just trying to cure my hunger. Now, granted, yes, I could have just gotten a cool wrap like I usually do, but I'm on the phone with my mom and my sister. They was like, get this spicy chicken, get your chicken sandwich. I was like, cool, whatever. I got a chicken sandwich, the spicy chicken sandwich. And I ate it and it made me bloat so bad. I looked like, I, I literally looked like I was pregnant. I kid you not, my stomach was out. Like it just, it was crazy. I bloated so bad. I go to bed like normal. I got my little skims, like I'm comfortable. I wake up in the middle of the night in sweat. Like I was, clothes was kind of sticking to me. I was just so sweaty and hot. So I get up, I'm fiddling around, I'm trying to be quiet because obviously Avery's sleeping. I go to my thermostat, I cut the air down so it could cut back on. Air is on. And hear me out, I get naked at this point. I get naked, I lay back down. Covers off of me, I'm just laying in the bed because luckily I have a vent like right over the top of me. So I'm just laying there like a starfish, like just the air blow on me. That helped. But when I tell you, I don't know about y'all, but whenever you are like sick, like nauseous sick, the feeling ain't even down here. Like stomach hurting it's up here so i was like i am getting ready to throw up all over the place like what in the world so i go into the bathroom i go to the bathroom when i tell you i probably was up and down at least five times last night between using the bathroom between gagging i didn't actually throw up but using the bathroom i'm sitting beside the toilet i had laid my robe out on the ground and i i remember at one point in the night i laid down on the ground I just laid on the ground because I was so sick. I couldn't even think about getting in the bed because I'm like, I'm gonna, I don't want to throw up on my sheets. Like I don't want to throw up in my bed. So I'm like, I'm just gonna lay here on the ground. And I did that, y'all. I was so sick. Even right now, my stomach is still very weak. I'm not going to the gym today. I'm just gonna rest my body because I just feel very like very sick. Even right now, I still feel really sick. So I just ate a granola bar just to put something on my stomach, and I'm drinking, I'm drinking water. Um, and that's it, I'm just kind of chilling because the way I feel, to be, I have to chill because I'm telling you, if that feeling right here is still there. I feel like I have to like, oh yeah, I do not feel good. So when I say I didn't got sick out of nowhere, I pray it's a short lived situation. I was talking to my sister and she was telling me that it could be like this 24 hour virus that's going around. I mean, I was completely fine up until the middle of the night. And it's, I mean, to me, I just don't say it as a coincidence that I eat Chick-fil-A, something that I don't even, I haven't even had a spicy chicken sandwich in I don't know how long. Avery, you stepping on my laptop. I haven't even had that in so long. So honestly, to me, I'm like, well, dang, that'd be a hard coincidence if I got sick from a virus on the same night I eat that. I don't know, and then she was telling me how they supposedly changed ingredients in the chicken sandwiches. You know what, I don't even care. I won't, I'm not eating that ever again. If I go back to Chick-fil-A, I'm just going to get my cool wrap like I usually would get, because that doesn't bother me. I've eaten that plenty of times and that did not make me sick whatsoever. So when I tell you, I just feel, even now, I just feel terrible. Luckily, I didn't have a lot planned to do today, but I did want to film a video. I wanted to film a hair video, and I also wanted to I have a couple of things to do on the computer. I got some editing I'm gonna doing so I can get a new video out and um and I may have to go I need that burp I may need to go live with 
a sponsorship today. I'm not sure yet. They were asking me when I wanted to go live, but I'm like, well, y'all tell me when y'all want me to go live. So yeah. So I hope I feel better within like the next hour or so, because there was literally two things I wanted to film today. Like I bought a bunch of the Wind Beauty uh, makeup products. I wanted to try out the um, Serena Williams makeup. I wanted to do a video on that. And then my hair, I actually low key may just wait to do my hair tomorrow because that's way more work. Me doing my makeup is not as like, not as crazy, but yeah hopefully within the next hour so i'll feel better but i can't even think about picking up a weight going to the gym so i'm just not yeah yeah i still feel sick mm -hmm. but anyway um i was on the phone with my sister we just got off the phone so yeah i'm just chilling i'm just trying to get myself together because i don't know what the heck happened to me last night but if only y'all could have been a fly on the wall to see me y'all would have been like somebody come get Jalen. I was literally on the floor just hurt i'll pop back up here a little bit later and once i kind of get myself together, I still feel, when I say I just feel so weak and fragile, I really might not even eat anything heavy today. I'm, I literally might just get a smoothie from somewhere and just drink it, like keep it light on my stomach today. It might be one of them days. I'm trying to see how this granola bar is gonna settle on my stomach. Cause if that gets to turn me up too, I'm just not gonna eat anything. I get some soup or something, I don't know. But anyway, I'll be back a little later, BRB. Ooh. Hey guys, take my bonnet off. Um, it has been a little while later. I ended up taking a nap, a well needed nap. I still feel pretty kind of, well, I want to make me a, I don't even know. I'm just gonna make me like two turkey sandwiches with some lettuce and then I'll make some protein chips. I'm feeling, like I guess I have to take it a little easy so I can just kind of figure out what's going on with me. Yeah, I thought I could take it my nap. I would feel 100%, but I do not. I still feel very weak on my stomach and that's been pretty much like my whole situation or my whole ordeal. I just feel very, very, very weak on my stomach. So I'm gonna try to eat something. I ended up ordering some soup because I just have, when I say I have no energy, like this is so weird. And this is exactly why it's like, I don't I don't know what I'm sick with, so I'm not gonna even say it's anything. But this is why it's so important to like, take your rest days, listen to your body. Cause imagine me going to the gym. Embarrassing. Yeah, imagine me trying to go to the gym right now. Like my legs are weak. My legs are weak and I just, boy. But I'm moving and I am grooving and I am. So once I make me some, what time is it, four o'clock? Oh, it's 5.30, embarrassing. Um, once I make me some food, I'm gonna sit down. I wanna post something to Instagram. So I'm gonna do that and then just chill out the rest of the evening. I got some mail, I need to go get downstairs. My other one or active order is downstairs. Excited about that. That's my other, um, the other stuff I had ordered. So those are downstairs, so I'm gonna go get those. Hi, Mom. Hey, Charlie, you okay? I am making it, honey bones. So that sandwich made you sick? Yeah, that's what I'm like, that's what I'm boiling it down to. Man, because man. I was fine. I mean, even after I ate it, I felt kind of funny, but I just figured, I was like, mm, I haven't had this in a while, and I was bloated really bad. Like, I, I wish I would've took a picture. I could've showed you how far my stomach was out. I looked pregnant, but again, I bloated really bad when I used to eat that food anyway. And, um, oh, okay. so yeah, when I got in the bed, I had broke out, and um, I woke up in the middle of the night just sweating. My clothes were sticking to me. I cut the air down, so it, you know, cut on or whatever drunk some water, fell back to sleep, woke up again. And when I say I probably camped out of the bathroom the rest of the night. I was, um. Were you throwing up? And I was feeling yeah. nauseous the whole time. I never threw up, but I it was to the point that I had to lay beside the toilet because I didn't want to accidentally throw up in the bed. I don't know what, I don't know. I guess I was just so hungry yesterday and then just kind of laughing about how I supposedly lost weight. So I was like, I'm gonna just eat what I want tonight. No ma'am, I should've just got a wrap. Cause eating that cool wrap, that does not bother me. That's totally fine. Right. Or get the grilled chicken sandwich. Jalen, you went to the end. You went to the fried and you spicy. Fried and you not, oh God. Fried and spicy? 
I got this. Oh yeah. I got the spicy your, chicken, honey. Your stomach was like. Your stomach was like, are you kidding me, right? Yeah, I've learned. I learned my lesson. I can't go back. No, I'm just picking at the way you saying stuff. All right. <laughs> I don't know what I'm gonna eat for supper. I just make it me a protein and drink it. Joe Beans and just drink all that the rest of the evening and clean up. Mm-hmm. Grace and peace, you guys. It is almost nighttime. Again, it's 7.48. Look at my tulips. Like, they didn't opened up and started falling down. What in the world? Anyway, it's almost eight o'clock. I'm feeling a little bit better. I ended up taking me, not a super, super long nap, but just a good, amount <laughs> of a nap um, that I needed just to get some rest. Mm. I don't feel, I mean, I, st I feel okay. I feel a little bit better. I still feel kind of weak on the stomach and just weak in my body. Um, I'm gonna go downstairs and go check my mailbox. I'm gonna see if I have enough energy to go do that. And honestly, I'm just gonna come back up here and probably get ready to go to sleep <laughs> for the night. I might do I might read a little bit I've been editing so I've been making myself somewhat useful even though I've been on rest mode today um so I edited a vlog I got some content out I got some other stuff planned I got one more thing I kind of want to do um I had to place an order for some stuff and then I might I, think I gotta I, that's what I'm saying that's why I need to go check my mailbox I, think I gotta yeah I gotta uh, not a speeding ticket I gotta um you know like when you go through one of the tolls they took my they took a picture and I think they sent something to me in the mail because it was like a violation. Because I don't have one of those express passes on my car. So I think they sent me something in the mail to pay. So let me go get that the city stuff. Lord have mercy. Let me get up and take a shower in a minute just to kind of refresh myself and then get back in the bed. Because I can already tell that's, just, that's all the energy I'm going to have. <laughs> Once I do that, I'm going to be done for. So I ended up eating a granola bar. I had a little muffin and then I had some soup I door dashed from Chick-fil-A, which ironically I went back to Chick-fil-A, but um, I just got some chicken noodle soup and some crackers. So that really did help. And then of course I was hungry again cause that won't nothing but broth. Ooh. Oh, I made me a turkey sandwich. Just had like turkey and lettuce on it and some protein chips. And then I've just been downing water. I've just been drinking all of this. I don't even put ice in it at this point. I just. I just fill this up and then when it runs out, I just refill it. So I've just been sipping on water and that's pretty much it. So I probably won't even eat anything else tonight. I'm gonna just see how my body just, I don't know. But anyway, so yeah, I just want to officially close out the vlog. Thank you guys so much for watching. So as always, if you're new, I'm Jay. If you're not new, I just want to thank you so much for supporting me with whatever I do here with my channel. I love each and every one of you to know in. And of course, until next time, God willing, I will see you all in my next video. Bye.